police officers are asking Jamaica were represented in the stands. The land of wood and water. Event number five, section two. Two Vincentians side Black by Black side Black in this one in lanes of five and six. There's the lineup now for the second section. Raven Walkin of Turks and Caicos, Darius Moore of Trinidad and Tobago, Brian Isaac of Grenada, Kenny Moxie Jr. of the Bahamas, Jaheem Williams and Matthew Robinson, both of St. Vincent and the Grenadines, Matthias Serian of Guadeloupe, and Jamard Huggins, the very talented Jamard Huggins of St. Kitts and Nevis, goes in lane number eight. Lane number seven. Moxie, a lot expected of him. His father is an assistant coach with the Bahamas team. Also qualified for the pole vault at these games, but uh, opted to focus on uh, the octathlon. Bahamas, of course, very strong in uh, pole vault as well. Um, see Huggins there on screen from St. Kitts and Nevis alongside uh, Seren from Guadeloupe. Jamar Huggins, a double bronze medalist in the under-17 category in Kingston at 110 hurdles and 400 hurdles. Did the octathlon at Carifta 2023 in the Bahamas. And with more experience, he's expecting to do well here. This is an event where he wants to have a really On good start. If he is to medal at Carifta, he has to deliver big time in the 110 hurdles. Stan. Raven Walkin of the Turks and Caicos, he too is coming Stand, up please. the Jamaican High School Championships for Kingston College where he won a silver medal in the decathlon. His older brother is a double Carifta bronze medalist in the throws from last year, shot put and discuss at the under 20 level. And the captain of the KC throws team as well. And there you go. Very well spoken young man. Mm -hmm. Says he hopes to make a big contribution down the road uh, as an administrator or coach in the Turks and Caicos Islands. Yeah, I think he's going to be premier one day, to be honest. I think so. He might be premier of the Caribbean at the rate he's going. <laughs> <laughs> That's for sure. Second section of the Octathlon boys, 100 meters. Walking in lane one for the Turks and Caicos. Moxie of the Bahamas is to be watched in Sir. four. Hoggins in eight for St. Kitts and Nevis. And there's a jump from Darius Moore of Trinidad and Tobago. Fortunately for him, in the multi-events, the false start rule a little different from the regular events. And so he'll have another shot at it. No need to be too alarmed. And I was getting ahead of myself earlier when I said that Jamar Huggins needs a big start here. Thinking about the Aptathlon for the girls, not realizing that no hurt is in the way for the boys. And so it's 100 on flat, but still one of his better events. And so he'll want to get away well. Moxie in four of the Bahamas is to be watched. Saw him in training yesterday over the herders. Looked really good. Looks primed for some big performances over the next two days. Set. Off they go. Walkin got up well in lane number one for the Turks and Caicos. Moxie has work to do coming through from St. Vincent and the Grenadines is Robinson. Moxie now coming through, but Walkin will get it from lane number one. It's 11.23, not as fast as we got from Osman Holt in the first section, but it's Walkin who takes section two for the Turks and Caicos. Nice and easy and Moxie in striking distance there. Walkin will be very pleased with his effort. Getting off to a very solid start here at the Kirani James Stadium. Yeah, 11.26, that is 804 points. And that will put him in third position overall at the end of this first event. Moxie looks in a little bit of pain there. I'm not exactly sure what happened. But here is Walkin getting a solid start to his octathlon campaign. Yeah, doubled over there. Very evident discomfort um, was uh, Moxie. Let's see if we see anything uh, from the replay. Uh, aside from Walkin getting off to a flyer. 
Moxie uh, trying to stay within touching distance and you can see him perhaps just grimacing as he comes across the line there. Uh, a little bit of uh, something he's feeling and then he uh, gripped his midsection. So walk in 11.26, Moxie 11.32, Robinson, St. Vincent, and the Grenadines 11.42, Serena of Guadeloupe 11.64, Isaac 11.65 from Grenada, Moore 11.66, Trinidad and Tobago, Huggins 11.69, and uh, Williams 11.71. Which means it's officially a no jump. Except with what the Bahamas.